Hey everyone, this is Mark. Welcome to my channel and welcome to this video. Uh, happy Thursday to you. I had to think about it for a second what day it was. Uh, weekend is almost here, so hope all of you are doing uh, really good. Um, it is dreary, overcast, and rainy here in good old Delaware, but I hope wherever you are, uh, you're getting a little bit better weather. But it's not cold, so I'll take it. Um, so today, uh, in our ongoing series, this is, uh, I believe, the third episode episode three of Essential Albums. If you're a brand new uh, collector, new to collecting Elvis vinyl, CDs, uh, even books, anything Elvis related, um, this is a series I'm going to continue doing uh, to give some of you that are just starting out some insight, some good information um, on what's available and uh, why it's a good uh, release. So we're going to talk about, as you can see in the thumbnail, this is Elvis Showroom International. Um, much in the fabric of the, uh, that's the way it is. Um, it was taken during the same time. Fantastic shot of Elvis on stage. Um, now there's two versions of this. You can get the uh, less expensive version. Same exact thing. Uh, there's no difference. Um, I do have the record store day release. I've had this for quite some time. Uh, it is the complete August 12th dinner show. Uh, 13 tracks previously unreleased, um, 180 gram audiophile vinyl, which is on the standard version. Um, this one, it's record store day release, and it's it's individually numbered. Uh, my number is, as you can see, 674. Well, like I said, the back is just like uh, similar to That's the Way It Is. I don't know if the pictures are exactly the same way. I believe, I believe they're very close or the same. Um, so what is on this album? Like I said, you can buy this just regular vinyl. I think it's, I think I've seen it as cheap as 30, 35 bucks for the, uh, the two LP, 180 gram set. Or if you find the record store day and they're individually numbered. Last I saw it online, it was like 60, 65 bucks. So it's almost double if you get the record store day version, uh, which I guess was considered a limited edition one. Um, but, uh, what songs are on this? So again, it's the August 12th dinner show. So side one, yeah, that's all right. I got a woman, hound dog, heartbreak hotel, love me tender. Side two, I lost you. I just can't help believing. Awesome song. Patch it up. Uh, one of my favorite songs, 20 days and 20 nights. Uh, very heartfelt. Side three, you've lost that love and feeling. Pokes out at Annie. Introductions, blue, blue suede shoes. And then side four, you have You Don't Have to Say You Love Me, Bridge Over Troubled Water, great, great song, Suspicious Minds, and of course, The Closer, Can't Help Falling in Love. Um, so yeah, a, a really great release. It is released by uh, Legacy Rec or Legacy uh, Music or you know, the RCA Legacy uh, label, and they released you know the uh, uh, CD sets of uh, Aloha from Hawaii. Um, I believe they've released uh, Elvis Country, just to name a few. Uh, but these legacy releases sound really, really nice. Um, really warm, uh, very, just very rich sounding, very clean sounding. Um, but like I said, if, you, if there, there's two versions of this, you can get just the, just the standard black vinyl, which is what this is too. The only difference between that one and this one is this is a record store day release. It has the sticker on it and it's numbered. That's it. If you don't care about that, I'd say go with the, because you're getting the same quality, you're getting the same sound, same everything, except you don't have, it's not numbered and you don't have the record store sticker. So, and like I said, if you find this like this, it's almost double than if you find the standard release. And you can get this anywhere. I've seen it on Amazon, eBay, if you use eBay. Um, so yeah, very easy to get. But uh, Elvis was in great form for these shows. In my opinion, um, and I did the review on uh, a couple of the CDs, um, the Wonder of You FTD CD release. Uh, that was the very next very next day, August 13th. So this was the previous day. And um, that release actually has more songs on it. Uh, this was, I think this has, let's see, so five, nine, 13. So yeah, 17 songs on this where I think the Wonder of You has 20, 21 tracks on it all together, if you count the introductions. Um, so this one was a little bit of a shorter show, and Elvis did that a lot, but uh, he, some shows might have been three or four songs longer than others. I guess it depend on, depends on how he felt and everything, but um, this is a fantastic show. Uh, one of the first shows of the August 1970 engagement where they recorded. Uh, that's the way it is. Um, so you can't go wrong with this. Um, check it out. Uh, thank you all for taking the time to watch this video, 
and uh, be safe out there. And until next time, take care.